Hello beautiful souls and welcome to day five. We are moving along, aren't we? Today we will be learning more about building our self-esteem. But first, how did you feel when you woke up this morning? Did you smile when you looked in the mirror and said, Good morning, gorgeous. Are you starting to believe it? After just a few days of mirror work, you may see that it is already starting to make a difference in your life. Loving yourself means having great respect for you, everything about you, inside and out. The good and the bad. It is deep gratitude for the miracle of your body and your mind and your soul. Loving yourself is appreciation to such a degree that it fills your heart until it bursts, overflowing with the joy of being you. Think about babies. You can even think about puppies and kittens. Think how perfect all these little beings are when they are babies. They do not have to do anything to become perfect. They are already absolutely perfect. And they act as if they know it, don't they? Especially those kittens. They know they are the absolute center of the universe. They are not afraid to ask for what they want. They freely express their emotions. I mean, gosh, have you seen a baby smile and laugh? They laugh with their whole being and it's absolutely infectious. You know when your baby is angry. And you know when puppies and kittens are angry too. And in fact, the whole neighborhood knows. <laughs> yeah, those screams. Those kitten tantrums. You also know when babies are happy. Their smiles absolutely light up a room. And they are full of love. These little beings would die if they didn't get love. And once we are older, we learn to live without love, or we try to. But babies and little young beings won't stand for it. You were also like that at one time. We were all like that. When we began to listen to adults who had learned to be fearful we began to deny our own magnificence. And if we experienced abuse, we started to believe the bad things abusers told us. Now is the time to change what those toxic relationships told us. Today, put all criticism and negative self-talk aside. Let go of your old mindset. The one that berates you and resists change. Release other opinions of you. And affirm, I am good enough. I am worth loving. Today's mirror work exercise. Stand in front of your bathroom mirror, look into your eyes and say, I love and approve of myself. Remember to say it three times and try to repeat this affirmation at least a hundred times today. That's right, a hundred times. I love and approve of myself. Say it so it becomes your mantra for today. Each time you pass a mirror or a reflective, reflective surface, repeat this affirmation. Your journaling exercise for today. Write down some of the ways you don't love yourself, or ways you express your lack of self-worth. Do you criticize your body? Do you talk down to yourself? Write all those things down. 
write down some of the negative opinions you think others have of you. For each of these negative opinions, write down an affirmation to turn it into a positive statement. For example, you could change. My mother thinks I'm fat. Two, I am beautiful exactly as I am. That one was huge for me. Um, I had it from my mother, my uncle, whoever I can imagine I had it from. From two weeks after I had a baby. And my God, uh, after you have a baby, you know that every part of your body changes. And there's no way in two weeks you're going to be back to your normal body there's no way after you have a baby that your body will ever be back to normal you just have to learn to celebrate your new body and say to yourself you know what I created an amazing human being and my body is testament to that now Number three, make a list of all the reasons why you love yourself. And make another list of why people love to spend time with you. Post these loving lists where you can see them every day to remind you of how you love yourself and how others love you too. Can you imagine how wonderful it would be if you live your life without ever being criticized? Wouldn't it be wonderful to feel totally at ease and totally comfortable without those other people's voices in your head? You would get up in the morning and know you were going to have an absolutely wonderful day because everybody would love you and nobody would put you down. You would feel just great. You know what? You can give this to yourself and you can make the experience of living with yourself the most wonderful experience imaginable. You can wake up in the morning and feel the joy of spending another day with you. Thank you so much for joining me for today's Day 5 Affirmation. I do hope you that you are enjoying it. And I do hope that you are seeing changes in yourself. Please do comment below and let me know what changes are happening within you. Um, I'd like to celebrate you today. <laughs> <laughs>